so I'm back again. You'll have to excuse the sunlight. It's a really lovely sunny afternoon. Today I'm back again with a DIY project for you. I'm going to show you how to make a juju hat. Now this is what it's going to look like and what it is, it's a, um, it's a Cameroonian headdress. Um, I found it on Pinterest and they looked really expensive, they looked so beautiful and I thought well um, I'm sure this is something I can recreate so I went and I bought a load of feathers and these feathers are all from Amazon um, they weren't that expensive but I'm going to show you how to recreate this it's such a beautiful piece of artwork and you can put it in bedrooms, uh, living rooms, you can do it in different colours um, it's just such a lovely, it looks really expensive as well, I think, anyway. So I'm going to show you how to make this. Hope you enjoy this tutorial. So we're going to start off by painting the cardboard white. I'm painting it white because I'm using white feathers. Obviously, if you're using different colour feathers, um, paint it a colour that's going to suit. I'm then going to use a plate and draw around it. Um, this is the size of the hat that I want. Um, you can either go bigger or smaller. Um, so we're just going to cut that and then we're going to start uh, applying the feathers. I'm using three different types of feathers. Um, I'm using the long one for the outside. The shorter ones, um, they're going to be in the middle and they've got quite a smooth finish. And then the fluffy ones for the centre. I'm going to stick the feathers round the outside of the circle probably about one centimetre apart. If you have more feathers, then you can fill them in at the end, but I wanted to make sure I had enough of the long ones around the outside. I did actually go back and fill a few more in, um, just so when you hold it up, you can't see any spaces in between. You can actually buy feathers that are sewn together in a long strip. Um, you can use this, but I found um, buying them separately was cheaper. Um, it still gives the same finish. So for the second row we're going to glue the shorter feathers just a little bit inside the circle so we're covering the feather stems and keep doing this until we get to the centre. we're going to glue um, some feathers together to create a sort of a circle um, use as many as you need um, to create a, a like a puffy ball shape and then we're just going to glue that in the middle if you have feathers left over at the end just um, stick them in wherever you feel could do with filling out a bit more tutorial please also check out my social media links below and um, I look forward to seeing you in the next